pivot charts have improved in Excel 2010 and I'm going to show you the new filtering feature which is much easier than it was in Excel 2007. To insert a pivot chart I'm selecting a cell in the pivot table and then on the ribbon under pivot table tools I'll click options and in the tools group click pivot chart. I'm going to select a column chart type and the first one here which is the clustered column and click OK. That inserts a chart right on the active worksheet. I can point to one of the corners of the chart and make it a bit smaller. And to filter now I can use any of the field buttons that are on the chart. So if I only want to see a specific product or date then I can click the arrow and filter right in the pivot chart. So perhaps I just want to see April 7th and that filters both the chart and the pivot table. To remove the filters I can go back and click all and that shows all the data again. There's also a setting on the ribbon if you go to pivot chart tools and click analyze there is a field buttons setting that you can show or hide specific buttons that are on the chart or hide all of them.